Mitomycin, also known as Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin, is a medication used to treat cancer in the lining of the urinary tract and kidneys. It works by slowing or stopping the growth of cancer cells. It is typically administered as an intrapyelocalitial injection, meaning it is injected directly into the affected area. The dosage and timing of administration will be determined by your healthcare provider based on your specific condition and needs. It is important to follow their instructions carefully to ensure the medication is effective. Before using Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin, make sure to read the patient information leaflet from your pharmacist. This medication is given into the kidney through a tube by a healthcare professional as directed by your doctor. It is usually given weekly for the first six weeks and then less often as directed by your doctor. Since this drug can be absorbed through the skin and may harm you, it's important to avoid contact with your urine for at least six hours after each treatment. To avoid splashing, sit down on the toilet seat each time you urinate during the six-hour period after treatment. Then, make sure to flush the toilet several times and wash your hands, inner thighs, and genital area well with soap and water. If any urine comes into contact with your clothing, be sure to wash it right away and separately from your other clothing. When taking Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin, some common side effects like nausea, vomiting, and stomach-slash-abdominal pain may occur. You may also notice a change in the color of your urine, which is a normal and harmless effect of the drug. If you experience any of these effects, it's important to inform your doctor or pharmacist. While using this medication, it's important to be aware of the potential for serious side effects. Your doctor has prescribed this drug because they believe the benefit to you outweighs the risk of side effects. However, it's important to be monitored closely by your doctor to minimize your risk. If you experience any signs of kidney problems, low back slash side pain, signs of infection, or easy bruising slash bleeding, it's crucial to contact your doctor right away. Additionally, although rare, it's important to seek immediate medical help if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction, such as rash, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects, so if you notice any other effects, it's essential to contact your doctor or pharmacist. If you're in the US, you can report any side effects to the FDA, and if you're in Canada, you can report them to Health Canada. Before starting Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin, it's important to talk to your doctor or pharmacist about any allergies you may have. This medication may contain inactive ingredients that could cause allergic reactions or other problems, so it's important to discuss this with your healthcare provider. It's also important to discuss your medical history, especially if you have a hole in the bladder or urinary tract, before using this medication. Before undergoing any surgery, make sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the products you are using, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. If you are pregnant or planning to become pregnant, it's important to discuss this with your doctor. It's not recommended to become pregnant while using mitomycin, as it may harm an unborn baby. Women using this medication should inquire about reliable forms of birth control during treatment and for six months after the last dose, while men should do so for three months after the last dose. If you or your partner becomes pregnant, talk to your doctor right away about the risks and benefits of this medication. It is not known if this drug passes into breast milk, so breastfeeding is not recommended while using this drug and for one week after the last dose. It's important to consult your doctor before breastfeeding while using Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin. When taking Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that could affect how the medication works or increase the risk of serious side effects. It's important to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs as well as herbal products, and share this list with your doctor and pharmacist. It's important not to start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. This will help ensure the safe and effective use of Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin. If someone has taken too much of Gel Mito 40 mg Intrapyelocalitial Kit Mitomycin and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help. In the US, 
call 911 or the local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. In Canada, contact a provincial poison control center. Before starting gel mito 40 mg intrapyelocalitial kit mitomycin, it's important to have lab and medical tests done, such as complete blood counts and kidney function tests. These tests should also be done while you are using the medication. Make sure to keep all medical and lab appointments and consult your doctor for more details. Make sure to take each dose of gel mito 40 mg intrapyelocalitial kit mitomycin on time. If you happen to miss a dose, speak with your doctor or pharmacist to figure out when to take the next dose. This medication, gel mito 40 mg intrapyelocalitial kit mitomycin, is administered in a hospital or clinic and should not be kept at home. It is used to treat patients with low-grade upper tract urothelial cancer. The dosage and timing of this medication will be determined by a healthcare professional, so it is important to follow their instructions closely. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the U.S., you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.